morning YouTube <clears throat> so just wanted to touch base with you guys and uh, you know this this channels my life my life of sobriety my life in Christ my life on here and uh, <clears throat> I hope it helps somebody <laughs> that's my hope But got praise report. So yesterday, well, we've been looking for a place to buy. And uh, not easy out here for the, you know, for the, the poor man or the old school. Um, we're very old school. Uh, we work hard and we work for ourselves and uh, I, I'd like to say that it, at 46 years old I'm been working for myself now for I don't know I had my first job when I was 15 I dropped out of school and <clears throat> well actually my dad told me he says uh, he goes I don't understand man you you get on the bus, you go to school, and then you leave. He goes, why even get on the bus? Why don't you just quit school and get you a job? So I did. I, I got a job delivering <laughs> appliances for a resale shop. And the, the guy that I worked for, he had two resale shops. <clears throat> I lived in a town in Texas. And the town was split by the tracks, and on one side of the tracks you had the the um, colored people, and on the other side of the tracks you had the the white folks. Well, I didn't live in town; we lived out of town. <clears throat> so my dad would take me to work every morning and drop me off, and and uh, <laughs> I drove a little uh, Ford Ranger. <laughs> Uh, didn't have a license, um, but that's what I did. I drove, I drove that little Ford Ranger around delivering things that people bought, and mostly appliances, uh, refrigerators and um, washers and dryers and stoves and and stuff like that, you know. Uh, but anyway, I got paid under the table. I've always worked like that. Um, I've tried to work uh, blue collar, where you know you have a job and. You get paid a check and you punch in, you punch out and, and all that, but I've never really had much luck with that. Um, <clears throat> I just uh, work, I don't do well with other people. and It's something I've been working on for years now. <clears throat> Part of my character that I would like to see Christ change. And he has in many ways, you know, um, many ways. But um, I do have a beautiful mind. I'm not like most people. Um, I use 90% of my brain where most people only use half of their brain. So <laughs> the doctor showed me, he says, like, this is your brain and this is a normal person's brain. And when he showed me the picture of my brain, it was all lit up. And they showed me the picture of a normal brain. It was just partly parts of it were lit up. So... I'm a little bit different, <laughs> but I get a lot of stuff done. I can get a lot of work done, and, and what I can get done in five hours, uh, take a person all day to do. <laughs> it's been hard on my body, but I still I still do it at 46. I can get in there and knock stuff out in five hours, and it's done right. I'm a perfectionist, and um, but anyway, the praise report, right? <laughs> you know, get off start jabber john here <laughs> we've been looking for a place and we've put offers on places and it fell through and fell through and fell through for oh i guess it's been uh three years now we've been trying to um you know back when they gave us all them stimuluses and stuff uh we didn't spend ours you know we saved them we saved them we saved them and the you know we 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 make it, you know, 
we've been making it for the last 11 years just <clears throat> on my social security check and, and my odd jobs you know I'm a, a welder carpenter I can build anything um, I work best by myself and uh, and the, the things that I need help with I just get my wife in there for a minute to help me do the things I need to four hands to do and and then she's out of there you know and most of the time and and I'm back on my own again and um, and it's worked for us you know um, <clears throat> Yesterday we drove, we're moving. <laughs> and we went and paid the um, earnest money yesterday on a three bedroom, two bath, um, a double wide trailer house on a one acre of land in the mountains. <coughs> Which, if anybody's been following our channel, we've been trying to get some land for a while now. And, uh, it's not as much land as I expected, you know, to um, to get, but it's enough to to for the times that we're in. It's enough to, you know, if I had to, I could pile everybody in there if I had to, you know. And, uh, I'm I'm always thinking about others. <clears throat> I've already told two different people: just get your fifth wheel and come on, you know. It, we'll we'll figure it out, you know, and uh, <laughs> because I do I do love people. I used to not. Wouldn't even have a second thought about stealing from somebody or doing somebody dirty or or nothing. But I've, I've been a integrate man since two thousand and six. <laughs> uh, to do the math, I don't know, but uh, and more and more as the days go on, you know, I'm trying to do right by my neighbor, and I love the Lord, the my God, with all my heart, and and uh, I stay in a constant state of repentance because I know that I am not perfect like Christ. I want to be. I know that one day I will be. So lots of work to do. I just bid it on another uh, fence extension to a, a rock wall. They want to. The rock wall is only four foot tall, so they want a two foot extension on the top of that, so that it comes to six foot and give them a little more privacy. <laughs> and uh, so I put a bid on the, the 42 post. I got to put in and uh, four by four square tubing or three by three sorry square tubing i thought it was four by four but it's three by three for the uh verticals and then two by three for the um horizontals which i have to modify some to get the the paneling that they have they have chosen to for the privacy uh fencing and then i just got all kinds of stuff going on man it's like Yesterday I was so tired of it all caught up to me, man, and then I couldn't sleep last night. I have a hard time sleeping. And I threw my neck out. My neck's been kind of kinked up for the last, I don't know, I guess it's been about five days now. <coughs> but I feel better, and then once I go to bed, it's um, all kinked up again once I wake up in the middle of the night. And, and uh, it feels... Still, man, still, uh, yeah, so. But we have a lot of stuff to move. Um, we've acquired tool after tool after tool after tool for the last uh, 10 years. And um, so that's going to be a duty. <laughs> but that's what keeps us going. You know, God, God blesses us with the tools that we need to do the work we need to Give us what we need, you know, and uh, and to help others, you know. Um, the other day I worked all day for, for you know, just because. And, uh, and spent money out of my pocket to do so. 
but I know that, you know, it was God's will for me to do these things. And I'm not, I'm not boasting. I boast only in the Lord. <clears throat> I'm just sharing with you guys the things that I do, because this is my life on here. <clears throat> I believe we'll be reading in, in Mark chapter 7 next, and uh, I wanted to do a little video this morning and just tell you where I'm at in my life and, and uh, dealing with certain things, you know. <laughs> Quit that. <laughs> My wife's over here listening to me. <laughs> Try to do my testosterone sh replacement shots and she's bugging me. <laughs> but anyway, that's what I want to tell you guys is uh, share with you my life on here and, and uh, still clean and sober and, and uh, keep going forward, you know going forward chase the tree as i tell my brother he's not he's lukewarm you know <laughs> but he used to not be lukewarm see so there's growth there but um be positive stay positive I'm trying to stay positive and <clears throat> not easy all the time and i do get frustrated with life and, and caught up in uh Stressed out like everybody else, you know. And, but I keep God first in my life. Don't listen to everybody. Just have a heart towards the Lord. Remember David, <clears throat> King David, you know, he, uh, the Lord forgave him. He killed his best friends. Or, well, one of his friends is, uh, killed him for his wife, you know. And because of David's heart towards the Lord, he was forgiven. So where's your heart at? You know, a lot of people want to put the thumb on other people and say, oh, you're not going, you're not going to make it because you do this or you do that. It's like, okay, <laughs> well, you without sin cast the first stone, right? That's right. You guys be blessed. God over everything. Jesus is king. My king. The king. Bye.